Is it time to buy or sell PayPal stock? In this video, we're delving deep into PayPal. Our initial report was released on Tuesday, 30th April, 2024, and now we're here to provide you with a more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, like, and turn on notifications to stay updated on our latest analysis. Keep yourself informed to make well-informed investment decisions. Improve your trading decisions by utilizing our newly launched AI. Stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Benefit from AI's insights with free price predictions and in-depth analysis for 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please remember that this video serves informational purposes only and is not financial advice. Since April 26, 2024, our system has ranked PayPal as a strong buy candidate with a score of 6.53. Now, let's delve into the stock's performance during this period. The stock has shown a gain of 2.97%, resulting in an average daily return of 0.99% since it was identified as a strong buy candidate. The stock is currently in a strong upward trend in the short term, indicating a potential selling opportunity for short-term traders. A breakout above the trend line at $68.72 would signal a stronger upward movement. Over the next three months, there is a projected 11.56% change, with a return range of 2.76% to 12.88%. Looking ahead to the next 12 months, a minus 6.40% change is expected, with a potential return between 90.397% and net 0.638%. This implies a price range of 44 dollars to 67 dollars 49 after a year. Our latest update on PayPal highlights a stronger technical forecast for its stock price following Tuesday's trading session. The PayPal stock price experienced a 1.39% increase on the previous trading day, reaching $67.92 from $66.99. This marks a three-day consecutive gain. It will be interesting to observe if this positive trend continues or takes a brief pause in the coming days. On the last trading day, the stock price fluctuated by 5.12%, ranging from a low of $67.22 to a high of $70.66. Over the past two weeks, the price has surged by 7.08%, rising in seven out of the last 10 days. The trading volume also saw an increase, with 25 million more shares exchanged compared to the previous day, totaling 43 million shares traded for approximately $2.93 billion. Looking back over the past 52 weeks, the stock's highest price was $76.54, while the lowest was $50.25. Currently, the price stands 11.26% below the 52-week high, equivalent to $8.60, and 78.0% below the all-time high recorded on July 26, 2021, when it reached $310.16. Analyst ratings on Tuesday, April 30, 2024, RBC Capital upgraded PYPL to outperform with a hold action. On Monday, April 29, 2024, Monus rated PYPL as a buy with a hold action. On Thursday, April 18, 2024, Bernstein gave PYPL a market perform rating with a hold action. On Wednesday, April 17, 2024, Wells Fargo upgraded PYPL to market outperform with a hold action. On Wednesday, April 17, 2024, Wedbush downgraded PYPL to underperform with a hold action. Analysts have given PayPal stock a general strong buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a strong buy rating. Here are the signals identified for PayPal. The PayPal stock shows buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages, indicating a positive outlook. Additionally, a general buy signal is present as the short-term average is above the long-term average. Support levels are seen at 65 and 35 and 64 and 69, with a breakdown below signaling sell points. A recent buy signal from a pivot bottom on April 18, 2024 has resulted in a 9.37% increase, suggesting further growth until a new pivot is reached. Increasing volume with rising prices is a positive technical indicator. However, negative signals and a sell signal from the three-month MACD may impact short-term trends. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence. 
Sell signal. Pivots. Buy signal nine days ago. Bollinger. Buy signal one day ago. Short-term moving average. Buy signal seven days ago. Long-term moving average. Buy signal seven days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Buy signal three days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see short moving average. Buy signal six days ago. The long-term moving average. Buy signal 38 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Buy signal 91 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, risk, and stop loss for PayPal. PayPal has a support level at $66.99 based on accumulated volume, presenting a potential buying opportunity as an upward reaction is anticipated when this support is tested. This stock typically trades with good volume and experiences minor daily fluctuations, resulting in relatively low risk. In the last day, the stock had a price range of 344 cents, 5.2% from high to low. Over the past week, the stock's average daily volatility has been 3.9%. Let's start by discussing some fundamental data before we look at potential trading levels for PayPal. The price to earnings ratio, or PE ratio, is a key metric that compares a company's current share price to its per share earnings. A low P.E. ratio might suggest a lack of confidence in the company's future or an undervalued stock, presenting a potential buying opportunity. Looking ahead, PayPal's Q1 2024 earnings report is scheduled for April 30, 2024. Analyst consensus estimates stand at $1.20 per share, so it's crucial to monitor these figures as they can significantly impact stock prices. Now let's explore potential day trading levels for PayPal. There is no significant resistance from accumulated volume above, indicating the stock could rise quickly under favorable conditions. Consider entering a position and using volume to determine your exit strategy. On the downside, PayPal faces its initial support level at $66.99. If this support holds, it may serve as a good entry point with a potential rebound in mind. The consensus rating for PayPal across various analysts is a strong buy. Now let's delve into some recent insider trades. On April 15, 2024, Webster Aaron purchased 70,808 shares of restricted stock units Dash 1. On April 15, 2024, Webster Aaron acquired 31,470 shares of restricted stock units Dash 2. On April 15, 2024, Webster Aaron bought 31,470 shares of restricted stock units Beth 3. On April 15, 2024, Keller Frank made an insider purchase of 19,669 shares of restricted stock units Batch 8. On March 18, 2024, Webster Aaron carried out an insider transaction involving zero shares. After analyzing the 100 most recent insider trades, the insider sentiment is positive, with a ratio of 67.842. Overall, insiders bought 1,508,597 shares and sold 285,056 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $65.33, down to 3.82%. This stock exhibits low daily movements resulting in lower risk. A buy signal from a pivot bottom was identified eight days ago. Is PayPal stock a good buy? PayPal shows positive signals and is on a strong upward trend. Following the principle of let the trend be your friend, we believe it's a favorable choice at current levels and anticipate further gains in the next three months. Our analysis has been upgraded from a buy to a strong buy rating. Based on recent volatility and price movements, our systems indicate that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Wednesday, May 1st, we predict PayPal will open up $0.681 and begin trading at $68.60. It's essential to remember that trading comes with a high risk of financial loss. Before making any investment decisions, consult with a financial advisor. Please note that StockInvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By utilizing this information, you agree to take responsibility for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Share your thoughts by commenting below. What target do you have in mind for this stock? 
don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates. Wishing you successful trading and a wonderful day from all of us here at Stock Invest.